my children. You see the question on the screen. Evaluate integration pi by 4 to 3 pi by 4 x by 1 plus sin x dx. Here we could apply the property integration a to b f of x dx which is equal to integration a to b f of a plus b minus x dx. You apply this property. So when you apply the property, first of all, the integration, whatever it is given, see pi by 4 to 3 pi by 4, x by 1 plus sin x dx. See, I am taking this as number 1. So now I am going to apply the property on this. So where if you see that a value as pi by 4 and b value as 3 pi by 4. So when I am going to apply the property, the question it will be changes to i pi by 4 to 3 pi by 4 pi by 4 to 3 pi by 4 x can be written as a plus b so 3 pi by 4 plus pi by 4 minus x divided by 1 plus sine of 3 pi by 4 plus pi by 4 minus x dx. Now, it is nothing but like what do you see 3 pi by 4 plus pi by 4. It is 4 pi by 4. So, pi by 4, 3 pi by 4, pi minus x divided by 1 plus sine of pi minus x. So, now if you see a pi minus x so I am going to divide it integral i is equal to pi by 4 to 3 pi by 4. See pi dx divided by 1 plus sin x minus integration pi by 4 to 3 pi by 4 x by 1 plus sin x dx. As we know a top from this now 1 then we can take it as this also i. So now i is equal to pi, I'll take it out here. So pi by 4 to 3 pi by 4 divided by 1 plus sin x dx minus i. Now this i carry other side. So it becomes i plus i to i which is equal to pi into now, pi by 4 to 3 pi by 4. So, 1 by 1 plus sin x. See, what I am going to do? Multiply and divide with the 1 minus sin x. Divide by. Multiply and divide with the 1 minus sin x. So, when I am doing this question, see, now one, numerator it becomes 1 minus sin x divided by. So, 2y is equal to pi into integration pi by 4 to 3 pi by 4 1 minus sin x pi so 1 minus sin square x which is nothing but cos square x dx so now 2i is equal to pi into so now 2 also I am carrying to other side or we can do at last no issue so now if you do See, integration pi by 4 to 3 pi by 4. See, this is nothing but 1 by cos square x. See, 1 by cos square x, nothing but secant square x minus this one, sin x by cos square x, we can write it as secant x tan x dx. Now, 2y is equal to pi into integration pi by 4 to 3 pi by 4. So, now, directly, I'm going to do the integration now. See, Integration of secant square x, which is nothing but tan x. So, integration of secant square x is nothing but tan x. Minus integration of secant x tan x is secant x. Then apply the limits pi by 4 to 3 pi by 4. So, when you apply the values, now i is equal to 2, I am carrying here pi by 2. So, first you apply the limits tan of, say, tan. 3 pi by 4. So tan 3 pi by 4 minus secant 3 pi by 4. 
So this is a plus one minus tan pi by four minus secant pi by four. Now, so now I is equal to pi by two, then tan three by four, what you can write it? Minus tan pi by four, and this one, secant three pi by four, it is minus secant pi by four because it is in the second quadrant. So it carries negative. So plus secant pi by four, minus tan pi by four, and this is plus secant pi by four. Now I is equal to pi by two. Yeah, minus tan pi by four, minus tan pi by four. So minus two tan pi by four plus two secant pi by four. So then when you see this one, two two gets cancelled. I is equal to pi into then one. What I can write minus tan pi by four plus secant pi by four. Substitute the values of this one. This completes the solution. Minus one plus root two is the answer. This completes the solution.